The Spanish word. Crunching sims also changes depending on the seasons. Or this is a local sponge. Parents do have choices when it comes to selecting a school for their child, and they have many concerns about the school their child will attend. Let's take a look at why so many parents are choosing Live Oak schools. What I found was that the Live Oak District provided everything I was looking for. Cultural diversity, high academic standards, a superb faculty. We made a great choice. My son's been in the, in the program for four years, and he's really, really happy here. Well positioned in the center of Santa Cruz County, Live Oak School District meets the needs of today's busy working families, providing children with rigorous academics, convenient after school and daycare, and numerous enrichment programs. Use rough sandpaper first. Instead of coming over here and drilling it that way, you're gonna turn it around. Consisting of three elementary schools, a middle school, two charter schools, a homeschool program, and several preschools, Live Oak offers an intimate and neighborhood setting for your child's education. What's great about Live Oak School District is the choices that are offered to families for different kinds of education for their children. So I'd like you to use Adobe Go Live and it's on your dock. It's the green globe at the bottom. Longtime leaders in using technology in the classroom, Live Oak Schools integrate computers for enrichment activities, literacy development, and English as a second language. They have their choice of three different elementary schools in a s very small area. The community is small, the, there's a lot of parent participation. For families needing after-school care, Live Oak Schools provide a seamless transition to an on-campus kid care program that provides extended learning, homework support, and many recreation activities. Why did they put the holes on the top? Let's take a look at a podcast that a group of students did. Here are some tricks. First, here's an ollie. Teachers are great. Everyone's accessible. The teachers have been fabulous. I've had great relationships with them. My kids have done really well here. What was the relationship between the Soviet leader, the guy up in the booth, and the crowd? We like Cyprus because of its small size. They can get the personal attention that they need. So today, what are you working on for your podcast? Fashion Sense. Very good. The Titanic ship. Very good. El Salvador. El Salvador, and that's where you're both from, El Salvador. Um, I love the teachers. Everybody's loving and very nice and always individually trying to Pay attention to each one of the kids, regardless if their classrooms are big or small. I like the student-to-teacher ratio and the interaction that we're able to have with the teachers. Um, Why was that illegal or not so okay? What? Do you want to go ahead and have a turn? It's because they weren't following the law. When my child seems to need something, the teacher understands that, and they've done things beyond what was asked of them. And to me, that's what teaching is about, is very giving, and that's the way I see the staff here. Ball. They really apply themselves to making sure the kids are passing. They're not going to be left behind here. Además, la escuela tiene muchos programas que ayudan a los niños a, a mejorar, especialmente los niños que hablan segundo idioma. My son's already reading. I'm really, really happy with the school. I especially love having such a supportive principal. He's a really amazing teacher. And our principal has been really, really active with our PTA. One of the new business items is we got our beginning projected allocations for some of our budgets. I really enjoy that we have a good administration that's engaged with the students and with the parents. Un museo in los Estados Unidos. Museum of Tolerance. I really like the immense academic opportunity. There's just so much available to you. Then you're going to make observations using that dissecting scope? My son's a junior here, but he has finished his four years of high school in three years. He has gotten a better education here than I could have ever hoped for. Organisms or sponges? Live Oak schools demonstrate a long-term trend of dramatic increases in student achievement and provide advanced academic classes in literature, foreign language, and science. What I'm going to have you do at each of your tables right now is go ahead and measure out one mole of a substance that I'm going to put on your table in grams. I also think they're hitting academics really hard because they want to hit a very high standard for our kids. What temperature is that about? Well, I'd say it's about 70. Celsius? Or Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit, OK. There's such a wide variety of academic programs. We're working with science. We're working with international relations. 
We're working, of course, with technology, but also math, English. It's really a wide variety. Our table did one mole of baking soda. One mole of ethyl alcohol, and it's 46 grams. The teachers are really well trained here, and basic, the basic education is really good. Uh, their reading skills and math skills are up to par with uh, what the state should be, and that's one of the things I like about the school. Okay, can you say that sound? Er. That's right. Live Oak teachers are focused on developing students' reading and writing skills and use the highly effective Reading Recovery Program to meet students' individual literacy needs. Great Title I teachers, when my son dropped behind in reading, they got him back up to speed in 8 to 12 weeks. It was amazing. They work with him five days a week. Hungry is his big dog. How was your class trip to the farm? Oh, boring. Kind of dull. Until the cows started crying. Every week, the fifth graders and fourth graders come down to read with their buddies. I think it's really fun to be able to like connect with the littler kids and like teaching the little kids how to read. I've watched my kids learn how to read and write well, learn math skills, and I feel that skills are developed year to year, so there's a cohesiveness between grades. Nice! Good job. You're sounding great, but just make sure you hit every note so that we can all be together, okay? Here we go. One, two, ready, go. The kids get to participate in art and music activities, which is pretty underfunded in public schools. Deo. What do you guys say back? Deo. 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 The daylight come and we want to go home. The veins of the, the flowers are a slightly different color of yellows. They have art teachers who come in and parents who come in are really talented, and the kids get a lot of hands-on. We're doing the outline first and then filling in. That keeps the shapes really nice and clean. I love the richness of the curriculum, the fact that we have art here and music here, not just a little bit, but a lot. It's great. I mean, just what I was doing here, they're doing by themselves. So my kids have a very rich education. Stay tuned to Room 17 Fashion Sense. <laughs> I love that we are working to make a safer school. There's a no bullying tolerance policy. Every child ends up being awarded for fairness, citizenship. Uh, I mean, it's, it's great for the kids to know that they're their own little community amongst themselves and need to be good to each other to become, you know, good citizens. The school is a great tight-knit community. You can say hi to really anyone and they'll say hi back. Go, Diego, go! It's really diverse and we all get along because you get to know everyone in the school. You always have friends and you never feel left out. It's made a really good group of friends and we've made friends with the parents and it's a very close community. Parent and foster grandparent volunteers, along with university interns, provide a stimulating intergenerational atmosphere. It's a socially, economically, culturally diverse atmosphere. Ready, go! My daughter is half African American, half Mexican, so it was really important for me to have her in a setting that shows a lot of cultural diversity. My son comes home from, from assemblies talking about caring and being nice to people and tolerance and I don't think you can overrate that. I think that's a really important environment for, for kids, especially young kids, to be in. I just love the yeah. friendships between the parents and the kids, how much trust there has been developed between all of us. I like the fact that there's a parent in the classroom every single day, so we have a lot of parent participation. We have great uh, parent involvement and community support on the campus. Lo que me gusta es que la comunidad y la comunicación que hay entre los maestros son son como una familia. They have many open houses, lots of parent-teacher conferences. There's many opportunities for me to be a resource to kids as well as to teachers, and I really believe that our school system benefits when parents contribute in all the different ways and with all the different skills that we have. They have a spring fiesta, they have a harvest festival, their fundraisers are great for the kids to be involved with their school and show appreciation. They're active in recycling. I love that we have a garden, a life lab, really close and accessible to my kids. Welcome to the plant sale. We have a Green Acres uh, science garden that 
promotes recycling, promotes growing plants, growing things, and make meals from the things they grow. And it's a great way to understand the process of, of living things. So all of the power from that pump is coming from this one solar panel here. And being kind to our environment. That's a big part of the emphasis at our school too. This is such an exciting evening. This is our annual garden festival when the entire community comes out and celebrates our school, our community, the school year and spring. It's great. Caring teachers, strong academics, cultural enrichment, and involved families are among the many reasons parents are choosing public schools that shine. When you consider the options, Live Oak Schools just make sense. I'm just glad that they're in this public school. We love Live Oak Schools! Live Oak, it's a great community, great schools. The daylight come and we want to go home. So we'll see you next year.